There are no dumb questions, only dumb people. <laughs>
young man. Hey guys, Brian here. What a beautiful finish by the new guy, Philly Ray, and Henry not wanting to trade Queens. And look at the beautiful job that Ray did here um, with the protecting his king, right? And utilizing his three remaining pieces here. Beautiful fortress by Black. And this Queen F4 move is so devastating because look at the square control. I always say good players focus on square control. This queen, I mean, this king can't do anything, man. It can't. I mean, you know what's coming up next, and basically the only way to stop it, Henry played this, but I mean, you have to kind of do this, and obviously it's not going to be pretty for, for White there, but uh, wow, what a fantastic finishing, mate. Double discovered check, and boom, that is pretty. Nicely done, Ray, and man, Henry had some chances here. Remember when the Eval bar was going crazy in the, in the opening? Yeah, that's kind of where his chances were, and we're going to go over that and much more, but uh, but great. Great made by the new guy, Ray, and Henry put up a fight. He had his opportunity, just couldn't capitalize on it. But it's very, very hard to see when you're the one playing. So real quick here, the inflection point, I think, for um, it went from 1.2 to negative 8.1. We saw what happened here. Um, take, take, take. So going back here, maybe knight c5 instead, and this could be one continuation. The game is a little bit better for white at 1.0, so... In case any of you are wondering there. But let's go where to the point where Henry kind of had some chances here. And we get to this point and we had rook e8 and then queen c2. Let's go move back. Will be another move for white here. Remember, always um, ask yourself what changed in the position, right? So rook here, no longer guarding the square. Do you sack? You prep it first, bishop, or I'm sorry, knight g5, and now even if the rook defends, right, you have bishop takes, rook takes, no problem, just you know, two for one. I mean, the rook for knight and a uh, and a bishop, right? So, but what do you play here as white? Yes, queen b3. So that's going to be a problem for black. Um, going back here, if you decide to not take and play something like king h8, then just simply knight here and you have the fork. 
So that was one idea for, for white, but I'm going to go here in this position and in the game, look at the eval bar, right? It goes back down and then it goes back up and then back down. So let's go move back here. Instead of bishop b3, will be another move for black here. I'm sorry, for white. Yes, bishop takes f7, check. Let's go over some variations. If king takes, then you're going to bring in the knight and... I mean, are you really going to hop out here, <laughs> right? I mean, no. So let's just discover if king f8, then you have your choice here. You can go for the fork directly, or you can um, pile on the pressure, queen b3, threatening mate, and you're still going to um, have the fork in the air. So that could be one continuation. Going back here, if king g8, then you have the queen check, and boom, everyone knows this, right? You should know this by now. It is the smother mate pattern, knight check, double discover check, queen sack, and mate. So going back here, if king f8, just going to get mated here. And if, um, I mean, you can only block it with this and take, and white is winning. So that was the the opportunity for, for Henry, but very, very hard to see when you're the one playing. Great fight, Henry, and it was a great mating uh, combo by the new guy, Philly Ray. And that was very, very beautiful indeed. Really took advantage of that square control. Double discover check and beautiful mate to finish it off. Great defense. Great utilization of all the pieces. Sign of a great player. Nicely done, Ray. Great fight, Henry. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought of the game in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe at the notification. Thanks. We'll see you guys tomorrow.